In this video, we talk about the security being built in the Bally Crypto Wallet. Let's get started. First, as a user of the Bally Crypto Wallet, we should try to understand how the, the hardware wallet has been built and you can find out more information on the on the engineering process ballycrypto.com term the whole process a two factor key generation process and they have said that this is their industry first you can find out more information if you visit ballycrypto.com forward slash en forward slash 2fkg i have this website here for you to have a quick look while the wallet look extremely simple for the end user ballet crypto team has actually engineered a workflow that is extremely safe you should read up more Here are the steps and every single step has been taught very very carefully by the team so that the key generation process can be decentralized. Which created an extremely safe environment and the produced hardware wallet can be used by the end user with the peace of mind that the encrypted private keys and the pass phase are all handled in a secure, if not the most secure manner. Back to our slides. While for the end user, when we first receive the ballet crypto wallet, we should we should first look at signs of tampering by examine the physical condition of the crypto ballet crypto wallet while the very very first thing to look out for is has the wallet pass phases being scratched off are they intact the second which is very obvious is that has the qr code has the underlying qr code not the not the one that is on the outside but the underlying one has it been tail off so these are the two checks very very simple checks that any user that we that first received the ballet crypto wallet should do a physical scan of the entire condition of the wallet should any of these has been scratched off or revealed you should contact Ballet Crypto immediately and cease to use this wallet. If all things are normal, that pass the first level of checks. The second level of check is an inbuilt function which you should see on the mobile companion app when you first added the Ballet Crypto wallet. And within that wallet, there is a way to do a verify that function needs the following input first you have to add that your ballet crypto into the mobile companion app that's the first step the second step review the first four digits on your wallet pass phase you should see an uh, a verify scratched the the verify portion it should review the first four digits take that digit and verify it on the app you sh should it be successful you should pass your second check second level of checks and these checks ensures that this ballet crypto wallet that you are holding with has been issued from ballycrypto.com there are up to fourth level of checks first two levels of check should be good for most people well, if you are more technically savvy and you want to have the peace of mind 
then you should proceed to the third and the fourth level of checks. Well, the third level of checks need two inputs, the encrypted private key and the, the full wallet pass phase. Proceed to valleycrypto.org and you should be able to carry out this check very easily with the user interface on that page. The fourth check is to check if the encrypted private key can be decrypted by the wallet pass phase and this can also be done on the valleycrypto.org. Here is the page, general warnings before you specify your pass phase and any of your encrypted private keys. It is important that you do it on the offline environment. A computer that is permanently on the offline should be the best environment to work with. The codes can the codes are open source. They show you the way and the industry standard of how to generate the keys. Should you need to examine the algorithm? It is totally possible. This is the third level of check that I mentioned earlier. You need to put in your pass phase. This should generate a public key which you can verify on your on your mobile app wallet, on the physical Violet Crypto wallet. This is the fourth level of checks where you enter the pass phase, the full one, and the encrypted private key. And finally, you check if the decryption is done successfully. Finally, an inbuilt summary of the security features of Belly Crypto. Firstly, as an end user, you want to know that the entire engineering process before you even receive Belly Crypto has been executed using the 2FKG process. After receiving the wallet, you should look for any physical signs of tampering by examining the physical condition of the Belly Crypto wallet. Has the private keys been reviewed, the QR code? Has the pass phase been scratched off? Should any of these is a yes, refrain from using that wallet and you should contact Belly Crypto team immediately. The next level of check, which is using the verify function found on the Belly Crypto mobile companion app. That second check allows the users to check if the wallet that they have purchased is directly from BellyCrypto.com. While the third level and the fourth levels of checks are built for the more advanced, they check the public address and the fourth level is to check if the encrypted private key can be decrypted by the pass phase. And, all, and this third and fourth level of checks are fully reviewed on BelletCrypto.org and it is certainly recommended that user doing this should be done on a permanently offline computer. This sums up the security features that are built into the Belly Crypto wallet.